Hey everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm reviewing my Jansport Katahdin 40 liter backpack. Please click like and subscribe to join my hiking family. When I first got back into hiking, I realized that the backpack that I had as a kid would no longer serve my needs. It was heavy, it was uncomfortable, it was small, it was clunky, it just wasn't going to serve my needs anymore. And the more research I did, the more I realized that lightweight was the way to go. So being budget minded, I looked into lightweight hiking gear. This backpack kept coming up. Now, all through my life, if I had a backpack that wasn't a hiking pack, it was a Jansport. They lasted forever, they were technically what they call bulletproof, and I just loved them. So I figured I'd give this one a shot. The price was right, it was well under $100, and it was light, and it looked like it had enough storage to meet my needs. So let's get into it. For starters, there's a nice pouch up in the top that holds quite a bit of gear for all the stuff you need to access quickly or regularly. Nice big mesh pouches on either side and on the front. Plenty of areas for gear ties or carabiners. And probably the best feature that for, in my opinion anyway, was this zipper on the side. On one side, it allows access inside the backpack. Now this is where I kept my camp stove. So if I decided to cook, instead of using one of my hiker's fuel bars, I'd just reach in, grab the camp stove, and go. Made it very handy, nice feature. On this side, it's just a pouch. So, again, something you could access quickly, but it's not getting into the body of the backpack. Right here, there's a hole for access for your camel pack. So you can have your straw come out, and you can have free, unfettered access to your water without having to reach around for a bottle. I prefer the bottle, so I don't use this. Getting to the inside, there's a drawstring at the top to cinch down your gear or to allow extra height. So you can pack this thing a little fuller if need be. There's a pouch on the inside for your camel pack or for something else that you want to be able to access more quickly. One caveat I have about this backpack though. I'm six foot three and I realized on the first day on the trail that this pack was not meant for my body. The waistband is supposed to ride right on your hips so that all of the weight of the pack is on your hips, not on your shoulders. The waistband, no matter how I adjusted it, stayed right around here. So my shoulders were carrying all the weight. So it became very uncomfortable for me to carry this. My buddy Ahab, who's only a little bit shorter than me, he had the same backpack, we got them at the same time, and his worked perfectly. He never had any of the discomfort that I, I saw. So if you're fairly tall, this is probably not the backpack for you. However, it's a Jansport. It's a wonderful backpack. It's rugged, it's light. The price is right. So if you're a little bit shorter than six foot three, then maybe, the, maybe it's the pack for you. If you have any questions or comments, please leave me a comment below or send me an email at trailnameace at gmail.com. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Be sure to visit trailnameace.com to find links to products I've reviewed. Thanks for watching, and keep hiking!